Hello everybody, it's Vengeance, and welcome to another tutorial, um, this time with Hamachi. Now, of course, Hamachi, the freaking triangle of death, and how do you fix that, you know? I I was having so much trouble trying to get this wor to work, and, you know, I looked online for an answer, I didn't find anything. I swear to you, I didn't find any answer. But basically what happens is that you have a network adapter error. And, of course, the VPN status is also an error. And if you try to ping your friend, for example, it's going to fail. You can't ping them at all whatsoever. So, of course, the first fix is to uninstall Hamachi. So, you go to control, control panel. Actually, no, you don't. You go to your computer first, not the control panel. You go to uninstall or change your program. Hamachi. Uninstall it. And then, of course... You reinstall it. That doesn't work for me. So my next one was go to Device Manager. Here's the second fix. You go to Device Manager, you uninstall Hamachi, and then you reinstall it again. All right, so that doesn't work. Okay, here's the other fix that people use. You go to your services. You type run, enter, services.msc. You, you scroll down until you find log me in. Uh, right here, you want to stop the service, and then you want to start it up again. This should shut down Hamachi, and it should work. You know, like, just because you see here that it's fine, and I have a direct green tunnel, doesn't mean that it works. You go to details, and here, status disabled. That means that it doesn't work. It's not fixed. It, this has to not be disabled. Okay. So here's the fix I found. There is a Windows update that you need to download. I have it right here. Here are the letters KB3033929-X64. I will have a link in the description for the 64 version and a 32-bit version. Um, so basically what I did was I double-clicked it, and it installs. And if you get this error, you want to go to your services, and you want to go all the way down... Uh, let me see if I can find it started. It has to be stopped. You want to find a uh, Windows updater or something like that. Windows update. You want to make sure that's enabled because if you disable it, this will not work whatsoever. It's not going to work because Windows update is, of course, disabled. So if it's disabled, you go here, you go to automatic, apply, start. Windows update's not working. As you can see, it's now online. You open it, and as you can see, preparing installation. I don't need to do this, so I'm going to cancel it. Yeah, I canceled it. Stop. Disabled. Apply. Okay. The reason I'm disabling it, and I guess it's a good thing, is because for some reason it eats up my RAM. So Windows update eats up your RAM. I just disable it. I don't need it. But this is what caused me the problem. My computer would never update Hamachi because my Windows update was disabled. So here, it would never work. After you do that and install it, you're going to come back to this screen, and you're still going to have this specific error. You're still going to have the VPN status error, maybe. Now, the reason I say maybe is because in the network adapter, it might not show up. Like here, I'm missing the Hamachi tunneling. Like It's just, it's just gone. And there's a reason for that. That's because I uninstalled it. But if it's gone, there's, again, another simple fix for it. Oh, whoops. You want to go back to your s to run, enter, and then you want to type what you saw last time, the HWD or HDWWIZ. And then it says, welcome to ha add hardware wizard. Of course, if your hardware came with an installation, etc. Next, install hardware. I manually select from the list. Next. Then you want to go to um, Network Adapters, Next. And you want to click on Half Disk. You want to click on Half Disk. Now, you might do it from here to log me in, but I'm doing it the safer route. So then we just browse. Uh, you go to your Hamachi, which is located in your local disk C. Program Files 86, log me in. And then Time64. And if depending on what version you have, um, I believe if you have Windows 7 and lower, you want to click on Hamachi. If you have anything higher, you want to click on H HMDRV. Yeah, Windows 8 and above, you want to click this one. Windows 7 and below, you want to click this one. So I'm clicking Hamachi. Okay. 
next, next. And as you can see, there it is. Log me and Hamachi virtual Ethernet adapter. It's there, but it's still not working. All right? And if I turn it off, turn it back on, give it a second. Details, settings, disabled. It's still disabled. All right? So now when this is here, it shouldn't have the triangle anymore if you have done this. If it still does, I'm sorry, I don't know the fix for it, but this is my fix. So what you want to do is you want to then hit update the driver software, search automatically, and it should update it to Hamachi. Hamachi network interface, see? It updated it. It says three, but that's because I've done it multiple times. Then you want to go to your control panel. Network. Network and sharing center. And now Hamachi should pop up here. Beforehand, it do if it does not pop up here, when you have the triangle error, that means that it's not working correctly. But as you can see now, Hamachi is trying to be identified, manage wireless networks. Uh, ah, here. The reason why it's not identifying it is because you need to do one more thing. I'm sorry. I'm, I have no script or anything. You see that it says local area, net, er, local area connection. It's not supposed to say that. So what you want to do is you want to right-click, rename, and rename it to Hamachi. Done. And now go back. Identifying. Give it a second. It's trying to boot up everything. Turn it off here. Turn it back on. There. As you can see, unidentified network, public network. Boom. We're in. No internet access. Of course not. And as you can see, details, settings, status, operational. It's not disabled anymore. It's operational. It's working. VPN status, okay. There's no triangle error. And now, to make sure it actually works, we ping him. Look, we're getting replies. There it is. We're getting replies. We fixed Hamachi. That is my fix on Hamachi. I showed you, I think, four fixes. Um, hopefully, this works for you. This is, you know, something I found out about on my own. I had to. And I hope it does help you, too, because it is really annoying trying, you know, I was trying to find so many fixes. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh... Hope that it helped in any way or form. I will have the 32-bit and 64-bit in the description. And I'll see you all in the next tutorial. Peace.